Welcome back once again to the best show to ever be on the show, the, the show about the Thousand Pound Sisters. And there's some news. Oh my gosh, Dan, there's some news. Really? Right here. Oh my gosh. Marriage is over. 1,000 pound sister Amy Slayton splits from husband, husband Michael Halterman and moves out of home just months after son's birth. What? Oh my God. <laughs> no. No. Not Michael. <laughs> they kept talking about it on the show about how like the other sister married his brother and they got a divorce. They kept talking about that. And it's happened. Yeah. Oh, God. Wow. Michael is lazy and has been jealous of her atten attention towards the kids. They've been having trouble since last year. Well, look, like I, I could tell he was kind of a lazy dude. On I'm like, he couldn't even cut his fingernails. So that's a kind of a telltale sign. I mean, my finger, like, <laughs> from one long fingernail dude to another, I know how none of the pain. R.I.P. <laughs> the divorce. Tammy got married. Amy's getting divorced. Oh, the pain. Wow. Anyway, now we can continue with the show, knowing <laughs> the future. <laughs> oh, God. Yes. Oh, no, it's straight yes. to the house, too. Oh, yes. Cage. Little Michael. You can't have any dad. You're getting divorced. No. <laughs> Mom said she's out of here. You can't have my nanner. We're leaving. Ugh. You can't have no nanners. Hello? Oh, that's right. Someone broke into the Since house. Tammy's up in rehab, Misty and I come by her house to pick yeah, up something she Yeah, someone wanted. broke into the house. Or they're doing renovations and forgot to lock the door. I just need the crackhead to come jump around the corner. Her all of her stuff him. is gone. Oh, this is some bull. Hold on, I'm gonna take a video of this real quick. Look, they got the whole camera. What do you mean? The TV was still on the ground. What do you mean they took everything? Fridge was over here, right. the table was there. The kitchen sink's gone, the bathroom sink, the water heater's missing. They took it. Someone took the water heater? <laughs> they took the kitchen sink. Wait, wait. <laughs> the refrigerator's right here. What are they talking about? Her dresser that was in here is gone with the rest of the clothes and that was in it. And they took her clothes? Wow. What? I'd be devastated, like. That was her whole house. Like, imagine somebody coming in and taking everything that you had that meant anything to you. Like, like, like what? I don't understand. They took, like, all this weird stuff. Like, there's nothing there. And I don't even know if I want her to go home there anymore. This whole scene's weird. Stole dresser? Yeah, they stole her. No. Uh, what? Are, are they just trying to <laughs> make up some clothes? drama or something? What, what do they mean? They... But the, well, like, from the scene from the, the last one, do you remember the frame? Like the TV is like right there when you like walk in the front door. TV's yeah. still there. They're talking about how the refrigerator's gone. The refrigerator's over there. Still got everything What's on top up? of it. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you had two refrigerators, in which case, I mean, who needs two? They took her dressers <laughs> full of clothes. It was like someone came and like started helping her move out or something and didn't finish. And uh, they just came over here to shoot that and like lead up to her moving out at some point. Probably back with Amy because... She's getting a divorce. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Well, Tammy was in rehab fighting for her life. Somebody goes in and robs her house. <laughs> Jesus. The, the flip-flop from Amy here. Like, usually she's like, I doubt she's going to do it. And now she's like, she's in there fighting for her life right now. And they're kicking her while she's down. <laughs> I can't believe it. They done took everything she owns except for everything that she owned that's still in the except house. Her furniture and <laughs> her TV. All her belongings. You know? They took her dresser. How could they? Everything's gone. It's not, though. Amy literally has nothing to her name. But she does. Because there's... <laughs> Okay, whatever. I get to get over it. I'm gonna send Tammy back. Yeah, between little bit passing away and Tammy oh, gaining. Oh, okay. I see what they're doing now. Ah, now I understand. Yeah, little bit just passed away. She just got robbed. Oh, she's gonna fall off the bandwagon. It's gonna happen. But we already know that she doesn't. I bet they call her anyway. We already know that she <laughs> doesn't. But that's kind of like the appeal of the show, I guess, is because you you watch the show because of the train wreck of Tammy's life so far. And now that this is right. wholesome season to where everyone's doing right and Tammy doesn't even want to like get interviewed anymore because she's so over it. Like they're just trying to fabricate whatever they can. <laughs> yeah. It's especially around these two. Like these two right here are just like the let's let's go make up make up stuff. They went to the gym or whatever. I forget what they right. were talking about, but like everyone in like you could see like the cameraman like in the mirror <laughs> while they were talking about some weird thing happening in the gym. I don't know. It's it's yeah. I mean, she loves her home. She loves having her own place to call her own. And at this point, she doesn't have anything that's hers. Don't I, no, like, act like you're still paying for that place when she hadn't been living there for months. Right. And probably doesn't isn't going to for months to continue. <laughs> exactly. Uh, like there's, there's 
She, how long has she been in rehab at this point? Like, I don't know. She's like, this whole thing has been over like a year, and they're over there still paying. That, that lease is up. <laughs> right. <laughs> that was maintenance that came in there. Me and Tiffany haven't really done a YouTube video in a while, and I kind of want to make a video revealing my son's name. The fans don't know. Hey, uh, yeah, the fans. You got to make a YouTube video. Yeah. I forgot they did YouTube back in the day. Heck yeah. Oh, yeah. That's where they got, they got found on YouTube. They got to do a baby reveal. And Tammy don't know. So why not make a little bit of YouTube fun and have a guessing game type deal? Yeah, well, YouTube fun. That's what we're all about here on YouTube. Just having some fun, you know? It's, it's, it's great. Absolutely, baby. Heck yeah. Man, your hair is poofy. Jeez. All right, wait. She's ready for the... <laughs> she is already ready. <laughs> Demonetized already. Nope. Can't, can't post Damn. that one. On social media, I post a lot of videos. That's not changed. But my Yeah, she's got a lot of TikTok stuff going on. Ah. Speaking of which... Go going there. Hi, right, part two. Look at that. Um, Look at that. We didn't try to use what I was opening at the end of that other. Look at her. She's lost okay. weight. <laughs> she's, yeah. lo she's lost some weight. Good bit, it looks like. Those gummy worms. And a little bit of hair, too. I'm <laughs> 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 I mean, I wasn't, how did I not peep that? How I was staring at the gummy worms. She's over eating chocolate marshmallows and everything on her TikTok right now. Mm mm. Is they sour? Ah, that? Okay, she's got a filter on. Okay, I got you. I want to do something fun, but she just stresses me out. Why are you trying to stress me out? Jeez. Got time for you. <laughs> got time for you. Golly. I'm going to try to make the YouTube video, and she's like, there's. There ain't no chemistry between these sisters no more. <laughs> they, they, are, <laughs> they are done. The reason why Tammy's in the rehab is because Amy kicked her out the house. That's what, that's what, right. Oh, God. Yo, yo, Amy's the one that called Tammy. And then she's complaining about Tammy. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. What you mean? The question is Glenn. Glenn is the baby's name. I've chosen Glenn. Because <laughs> she's just... <sighs> that's the best you can do. She's not happy about Glenn. Yes, my sons are named after horror characters. Oh. Who was Johnny's Depp character in horror Friday characters. 13? Glenn. <laughs> a, I didn't watch that one. I didn't know. It's Glenn. You say, oh, good name. Look at that. that show her. I'm done. I'm done. I am, I, am, I am done. Sometimes you don't know if you're getting the Jekyll Tammy or the Hyde Tammy. Today she was the Hyde. <laughs> oh, dude, she's like... I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. <sighs> so Gage and Glenn are horror character names? What is Gage? Pet Cemetery. Oh, okay. It's Pet Cemetery. It's the kid in Pet Cemetery. Uh, That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gotcha. We Wait. need a a butcherist <laughs> instead of exorcist. We need somebody to exercise the butcher <laughs> to me. Oh, God. She's mad because she is exercising, all right? That's like, right. I love that. They just keep showing like how done with each other they are. Like, Amy doesn't even want to go visit Tammy in rehab. You know, right. It's like, I do not want to go. Mm -mm, no. But not I mean, me. like they did the TikTok thing and they're both together. I mean, together and having a good time for Tammy's uh, wedding that she had. So I, I don't know. It's, it's weird. I don't know if it's for the show or if it's behind the scenes. They are just over it. I hate it. Dude. I am so far away from my family. With a little bit dying. I, I was going to say, you just got a call and through a fit, you know, I don't know how much you really do miss them. <laughs> All right, she's ready. Right. To, she's ready. The drill. I mean, she's got to have lost Today weight I'm this time. If she, if she gained, if she gained more weight, Dane, oh my God. Three weeks ago, I weighed 583.9. 583.9. What's going on? Let's see it. 561. God dang. Yay. With no big buildup or anything. No big dramatic. Maybe. No. Okay. Okay. Well, fine. I guess it's like. Every success is like, oh yeah, she did it. Okay, anyway, moving on. Yeah. Being ten pounds away from my goal weight is, it's, it's great. <laughs> is it? <laughs> oh, wow. Is it? I love it. It is great, I guess. Yes. Wow. Jeez. I guess. Cool, man. Psych myself up for failure, but then when it's actually a win. I guess sometimes I don't know how to react. I feel that. Everything in my life, I always expect the worst. Like every video that I upload, I'm like, oh man, this is going to be like a 10 out of 10. Like, you know, the bottom video of that I've uploaded in the last 10. Every single time, oh yeah. man, this is going to be this. Or if I'm like 
going down the street and someone says, Hey, I'm like, Oh my God, what is this going to be? You know, it's never like, Oh, Hey, what's going on? You know, it's always like, right. do I need to fight somebody? What's happening? <laughs> Dude, I'm the same. People look at me and I'm just looking like, man, why are they mean mugging me? Like, what what's is going, going on? on? We got to, we got to, we got to fight. What's, what's happening? Do I have to pull out one of my 1000 different ways I've imagined this going down? To... <laughs> you got your move with the spoon already, man. You know what I'm saying? They should true. be careful. That's true. That's true. Hit that trach if I need it. I got the spoon. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, it's even like throughout my whole life, it's always been difficult for me to like let myself enjoy things because I'm always worried about I, 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 what they what they call it high functioning anxiety, to where I'm just wor always yeah. worried about the possibilities. But it also like helps me on some levels, like with work. Like I'm able to like always get my videos and my, like for years now and do all that stuff because I'm worried about the future. Like, I got to do it. Right. I got to do it. My job. Got to do my job. Can't stop. It'll fall off. Go, 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 go. But of course, it gets unhealthy to a point. Anyway, just saying she's a bit relatable to me. I get excited, nervous. Sometimes might go wrong. I don't know. It's just overthinking brains. That's right. What's going to happen next? They're going to tell you your house is broken into. Oh, my gosh. Ooh. Look at that. I got abs drawing a shirt running. Mm. What's me? To get in shape before I'm able to get skin removal surgery. The only shape I am is round, and I know it quite well. <laughs> oh, man. Chris is also relatable, too, because he, he keeps doing, like, the self-deprivation jokes and, like, making fun of himself. But at the same time, you yeah. know there's, like... Some truth to it. Yeah, you know, he's, like... <laughs> gets feeling down about it but it it's got you got to put on a happy face and laugh on it uh, laugh about it for the people around you yeah yep relatable know that feel it's hanging in about the right place <laughs> compared to back in the day uncle chris looks really good golly look at this lineup right here look at the boys these are some these are just some of the names that have been taken <laughs> off of the boy menu all right oh braxton these Nathan, are some Justin, of the Dylan. pristine ones <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, watch out for this new on the on down here. He's the he's the character. He's the mischievous. Yeah, the mischievous oh, one, yeah. the, the quiet one. The, he's he's the in the fields he's in, and he's the, he's in the band. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. <laughs> and then the skinny one. <laughs> These are yep. all Amanda's sons. Here he comes, the man. <laughs> he looks like Richard all Simmons. Right, baby. <laughs> ah, the heckling has began. It's like I ain't got started yet. And you guys are already making fun of me over here in the shade on the swing, not making police not reports like you said. Yeah. <laughs> Fire is heavy, y'all. Ooh, I'm the tire. You, it is yeah, heavy. You go. It's still the squirting. The tire flip. Oh. <laughs> it's flipping tires, just squirting the whole time. You ain't doing good, buddy. <laughs> this is going to be hard right here. Good yeah, Lord. expecting me to pull it. Oh, wow. Oh, come on, Chris. You got this. <laughs> They're really come up with some bullshit for me to do. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I saw that. I was like, there ain't no way, man. Golly. The man's about to flatten the whole thing. Put the skinny dude on there. You got this. You got it. Come on, Chris. You're he's doing pretty good, actually. I figured he'd be more out of breath than he is, but he's uh, keeping it together pretty well. Come on, you got it. Yeah. Oh, he didn't run up the hill. They made him run up the hill. Oh. <laughs> hey, look, now y'all just being mean. Don't make the dude run up the hill. Well, that's he'll... a crazy hill right there, Yeah, too. That's, that's a pretty crazy one. Good Lord. I mean, it ain't even cut wow. straight because it's so steep. You know, look at this. <laughs> I rolled down that hill on the way down. I can't wait to just walk in and actually see her in person. Oh, they're going to see Tammy. You're missing. I've decided <laughs> oh to take a trip. Tammy, uh -oh. you got, your house got robbed. Last oh. month. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Been a while. We figured we'd wait to tell you to make it easier on you. Like it's going to change anything when you first hear it here. Yeah. The blow would be so hard if they wouldn't over exaggerate so much. They, they like, as soon as they left the house, they were like, yo, girl. Everything in the house is gone. Everything she owns and ever loved has been destroyed and crushed, and her life is over. You have absolutely nothing. Except your couches, your fridge, yeah, your TV. Your TV's uh, still there. Mainly, they, mainly all the bed. stuff you left, except your dresser. Yeah, they took your dresser <laughs> and your clothes, weirdly enough. You're going to fall on your noodle. You're going to fall and hit your noodle. Whoa, drunk baby. <laughs> They've cut back to Amy and the baby, but I'm just like looking at the floor right now and the bottom of that baby's feet. Good Lord, this floor is yeah. nasty. Vacuum right. this floor, please. Like, I can, God, oh, what is that looking at from under there? Oh, Jesus. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. God, damn, what happened to the door? Just want to kick the door in. Wow. Jeez. Kate was mad. <laughs> There's no toilet paper on the roll. Oh, my God. There's not even a roll. What is that? Look at Mama on the potty. Look. Okay, what you going to wipe yourself with? Use the potty. Look. Come here. No. 
Oh, I thought she was oh. actually okay. I was like, God. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, no. Oh, this supposed to be the extra bathroom. Maybe that's why there's nothing in here. Guys, look. Mom, I don't want to watch you pee. It's weird, right? All right, later really that day. I really can't talk right now. I'm in a lot of pain. It's like a stabbing pain in my lower back. Well, goodness. She's in a lot of pain, stabbing pain. Michael's back there looking like he's about to fall asleep driving. <laughs> Let's be yeah. serious. I don't know if his baby coming. And we are kind of close to having the baby less than a month away. Yeah, for her not to be able to talk, she is sure just, just yapping it up, isn't she? Golly, are you in pain right. or not? <laughs> Guys, I'm dying right now. But anyway, uh, we're about to have this baby. How much longer should we get there? Because I'm really in comfortable. About five minutes. About five minutes from everywhere. Yes, that's the country life right there. When you oh, leave, yeah. your, when you leave your house, it's about 15 minutes away. But when you're on the road, about five minutes. I need family time. Video call is great, but I need that interaction. I love it. She's like, I'm so happy to see these guys. They finally come to see me, but they only come when there's bad news. You know, they came last time, made me a barbecue, <laughs> and the dog died, and then my house got broken into. I'm putting my proof in the pudding. Proof, proof in the, the pudding. pudding. Granny used to say that all the time. She's <laughs> putting the proof in the pudding. Yeah. I thought the proof was just already in there. <laughs> now you just got to put it in, man. Yeah, put it in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you said you've been feeling like a caged bird, so let me, let's get you out of here so you can fly a little yeah. bit. Why not? We'll just sign you out and we'll just take you. Because of the heat. Like, let's get you out of here. He's like, it's hot outside. I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> what are you talking about? Mm -mm. No, sir. It's summertime. I was going to say, I thought, I thought that she was going to use that as like a really poor segue. Like, yeah, let's get you out of here. We just can't take you home. Because, uh, <laughs> because you're wrong. <laughs> Why you keep shooting me down? Man? I'm not trying to shoot you down. I just got like things. Did I someone just fart? <laughs> I'm trying to shoot me down. It's like, why y'all <laughs> shoot me down? <laughs> what happens I mean, if I'm... I get out there and start coughing? Neither one of y'all are going to know what to do. Why well, they mad now? It's like, if she want to go, if she want to go, leave her alone. You know, whatever. Right. She, she's doing right. When the time comes and you get out of here for good, you won't even have to worry about that anymore. And That's what I'm saying. Like, a <laughs> like Tammy, they just kind of made up the thing of her even gaining weight because Tammy's been like, nah, I ain't leaving. I'm getting this done. <laughs> you guys can go on. Right. <laughs> By the way, your house got broken into. <laughs> when did they tell her? <laughs> right, we're back in the emergency know. room. Hey, what's wrong with Amy? She got heartburn? She didn't bust her stomach? The baby is fine. Oh, she is drugged up right now. Very healthy. They got her on some, <laughs> some, some pain medication. She's all good now. We're waiting on the... Some of them did tell me if it's my gastric bypass that's leaking or not. Dang, the ga gastric bypass leaking? You think she's she's done popped a leak from eating all that cheese whiz in the parking lot? Uh, she yeah. has not been dieting. Mm -mm. Talking mm -mm. smack to everybody about it too. That's true. Yeah, I saw the I saw the full sugar cokes in the trash can. You ain't he's sneaking about me. <laughs> right. <I know. laughs> Gallbladder was fine. My liver's fine. It's just really bad indigestion. <laughs> wow. Pizza sent me to the U.S. <laughs> it was heartburn. I'm tripping, dude. I can't. You call, you call it. <laughs> oh, wow. This should be a director. <laughs> oh, man. They just, I can't believe they just went and paid $10,000 to have all those tests done at the ER just to figure out some digestion. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Ooh. I get it. The first time I ever had heartburn, I woke up and I was like, I was, I walked in. I, I remember like calling my dad and was like, yo, dude, I'm dying. Like, I think I'm having a heart attack right now. <laughs> he's like, what's it feel like? I was like telling him, he's like, that's, that's just heartburn, dude. What's wrong with you? <laughs> I was like, oh. <laughs> Oh man, I just like love her face right here while she's telling us too. She's like, yeah, I had indigestion. I'm headed to the ER right now. Oh my god, this happened before. Pain. I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> she got it. She, it happened last time she was pregnant. I've been trying to eat healthy because of the baby, but. Sometimes you just have a moment of weakness and you have to do what you want. If you want a moment of weakness, good, whatever. All right. That was, her, her life lately has been moments of weakness. Oh, I think the husband's here. That's Hang on. Yeah. I guess the guy that they haven't really shown on screen is the, the one sitting off. Stop trying to... Yeah, I guess like this guy right here. I think that's the new husband. Oh. Pachinko. Pachinko, y'all. Pachinko. <laughs> what is it? Pachino. Oh, Pachino. Pachino, Pachinko. <laughs> She's been playing those Pachinko machines. Nice pachinko machines. God, oh, man. They are... They, it's like these little metal balls or whatever. It's like gambling, right? And... Oh, man, okay. 
That's what, that's what Konami did. Konami made all those great games back in the day, and then they got in the pachinko machine, and they just never they never looked back after that. They're like, Silent wow, Hill? Really? Nah, no more of that. You don't need no Silent Hill. You want more Castlevania? Nah, <laughs> none of that. Pachinko, <laughs> pachinko only, baby. Time. So where you get your hair, dude? Your hair's I in get the my beauty hair. room. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Oh, damn. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, get, get a new driver. Go, they're just running over everyone out here. <laughs> There's going to be like a small child around for them in a minute and just get creamed because they ain't going to be a stopper. <laughs> um, got some pretty serious stuff to talk about with you real quick. Uh oh, here we go. Um, serious stuff. So, you know, I room. told you I was going down to the house. <laughs> they put her in the beauty room so they can, after she gets upset, they can put her face back on. Somebody's went in and took everything that you have. The washing machine, dryer, kitchen sink. You see, <laughs> the washing machine, the dryer. They took the kitchen sink at the house. It's crazy. <laughs> Grandma's blanket's gone. Yeah, what about the rest of the stuff, though? You know, the, uh, I saw a blanket in the bed still in there when y'all look. I mean, Tammy's taking it pretty well. She's like, okay. Well, anyway, I mean, they did a good job then because I, I, you know, I'm surprised there's some stuff left in there because I told them to move everything out. I paid him 50 bucks. <laughs> right. And she's like, well, you know, I rented it and that's not my sink. So. Yeah. <laughs> Before I got sick, I would have been mad and, and threw a little baby fit. But after almost dying, I'm trying my best to stay focused and positive. It's so weird. I don't understand. Like, she's like, I'm being, being so positive. She was like freaking throwing a fit when she had to call the... The therapist the, the other therapist. day, yeah, it's just like <laughs> her whole day, her whole life was ruined. Amy called her. It was the end of the world. Hey, girl, your house got broken until they took everything. Well, anyway, I'm just trying to stay positive, guys. You know, it sucks, I guess, but YOLO. I want to move out and get, you know, my own place and get new furniture. And with the way I'm losing weight, they gonna, the clothes aren't going to fit. It is what it is. It is what it is. Easy enough, all, all right. right. All right, they keep they keep building up. Oh my God, I don't know what Tammy's going to do. Oh, she's going to she's going to eat all the babies when we tell her this happened. You know, oh my gosh, <laughs> she's like, whatever, guys, it's fine. I don't actually live there anymore, so sniping my stuff. Probably one of her ex boyfriends. Yeah, <laughs> probably the, exactly. B, the BBW King showed up and took her stuff. <laughs> I bought you the like, suit. <laughs> it's been a while since I weighed and I got weighed again. Very Doctor Smith. So yeah, I'm gonna go out and weigh. Sure, because it's right there on the way out. All right, yeah, yeah. Hit, hit that weight. Wink, wink. Let's see some weight for you go. You know, make you feel right. good. Decided to weigh myself because I want to see. Like, hey, <laughs> hey, guys, push me. <laughs> Don't let <left> me. <laughs> you guys are leaving. Come, come on. Every time I get on the scale, I'm always afraid I put on weight. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Now, now it's playing the music. Now it's starting to get intense. Now it's like dun 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 dun. That's what I was waiting for for the last to weigh in. So this is gonna be either right. she gains weight or she makes her goal. Which this has been the wholesome episode, so she makes her goal, right? Going on a high note. Yep, yep. It's always kind of nail bottom, scary kind of situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what happened. Burr, burr, epic music. Dun, ah, commercial. Five thirty four point seven. Bitch, are you serious? What? Good lord, how many? How much time has gone by? I wouldn't even. She was just five fifty or sixty the other day. 534, wow. good God. Wow. That's what I'm saying. It's one line. She actually ate a, on a decent diet there. Holy, they stopped giving her wow. spaghetti and hot dogs for every day, I guess, here. And <laughs> yeah. Show Tammy, me the scale. you see that? Oh, wow. This half her steps Where's up on say the scale. That? It's 534. This is going to be the first time you guys don't actually show me what the scale says. Right. The first time in Thousand Pound Sister history that it doesn't like zoom in to oh. what the number is. She has finally met the weight requirement for the surgery. Do they are they pulling a fast on us right now? I, I can't believe it. This is the ultimate heist right here. They just did it. Are they trying to bamboozle <laughs> us right now? I can't believe it. <laughs> What'd you do? Poop? Yeah. <laughs> not today. Girl, are you serious? I like that. You poop, not today, but if I would have, it'd been shoot. Down, down to 20. 14 pounds under my goal weight. Yeah, go time. That's wow. A huge shot. There's a lot. That's a whole bunch of weight. I did that. Yeah, you did that. God, now you get to go get <laughs> surgery. Oh my god. No, no, no. I just gotta finish therapy. That's true. You guys should have to go to therapy. It's all the emotions. Hooray. I proved everybody wrong. Sure did. Everybody god dang, got... he sure did. <laughs> In the yeah. fast, we've just been like, my god, there's no hope. But yay, she's doing it. Girl, yeah, I'm some, so freaking proud. Who's the other guy in the room? They got pushed back by the printer out of the way. Wow. I got this poor guy that's like freaking on oxygen and everything back here, just shoved here in the corner. So, that, oh man. Like, Hold up, man. You can't be on this shot, man. Get over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, get out of the way. You got a thousand pound sister coming through. All right. I love you. Love you. 
Bye, guys. I know, girl, she's got the finger tats and everything. Watch out, all right? Dang. <laughs> she's the person, if someone she's comes in here. Someone, someone tries to come here and try to stall, <laughs> stall, start some trash. Or, no, she's the enforcer. Someone comes in with like a McDonald's box and she's like, what you, what you, what you, pulls out the switchblade. <laughs> oh, not today. Leave her all alone to be sad, peeking around the corner with the camera. Give her some space, man. Anyway, that's it. You talk to your plants. Mm, you damn right. They're going to feed my belly. I'm going to tell them all about it. All right. <laughs> all right. That's the end of that episode. <laughs> with another whole episode. All right. Cool. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If today's your birthday, happy birthday. Stay with my friends. I love you. See you next time. Bye-bye.